Hi and welcome to Learn DaVinci Resolve and today I'm going to I'm redoing a video about audio noise reduction. I was pointed out that there was an error in how I did it before but that was based on information that I had originally got from uh, you know different people during the beta cycle. Now that 15 is released I want to show you the right way to do audio noise reduction. There's actually a couple different ways and I'm going to show you the basics here. First off, whenever you're shooting some video, you want to make sure that you have some ambient noise levels. So either at the beginning, before you say action, it's quiet on the set, make sure that everyone, no one's talking and that you're just getting the background noise. That's going to make it much, much easier to reduce that background noise later on. So here I've got a clip and I've extended my audio out so you can uh, see this was the ambient noise level. I'll play this. So there's quite a bit of a hum in the background. Now to fix this, we can go to our effects library, make sure we're on Fairlight, and noise reduction. Now, all I'm going to do is drag this onto the audio timeline. If I drag it over and drop it, now the noise reduction box comes up. Now, uh, if you've seen other videos of this, this may look a little different because it was changed in the final release version of DaVinci Resolve. So now we have auto speech mode. So if you don't have any ambient noise, just select auto speech mode and go and it's going to do a pretty good job of eliminating noise by isolating the speech. I'm going to show you how to do it manually when you have that which is going to give you a little bit better result. So I'm going to be on manual and I'm going to click on learn. Now I'm going to make sure my playhead is at the beginning of this audio and I'm just going to hit play and make sure I have a good sample. Now, if you notice, there was uh, audio levels up here before, and now they're gone. So I'm going to turn off learn mode, and we'll go back to the beginning of the playhead here. And that noise is drastically reduced. So let me get to some audio here. And I'm going to turn off the noise reduction. Five, four, three, two. So you can really hear that background noise. I'm going to go back again and turn it on. Five, four, three, two. So that background noise is drastically reduced. Now there is a lot of features on here to fine tune how the detection works, the smoothing of it, and the output. So you can adjust the threshold, the attack, the sensitivity, the ratio. You can smooth out the frequency responses and the output you can fine tune to your particular liking. I'm not going to go into those too much. They're fairly advanced, but I want you to be aware that there are features and if you want to fine tune it, you can. I can probably make this even sound better just by tweaking some of these settings and getting it as good as possible. For this particular use, this is about as good as I need to do. Hi, this is Kerry with Multicopter really Warehouse. So, that is the audio noise reduction within DaVinci Resolve. Now you can also do this from the Fairlight page, but it's the exact same process. You drag the noise reduction over, you get the same screen, and you can do all the same stuff. Now once you have that turned off, in your inspector you will see the noise reduction. So again, the same thing, speech mode, the learn toggles, noise only, threshold attack sensitivity, time smoothing, so you have the same settings, so you can always come back and tweak those if you need to. So hopefully this has helped uh, resolve some of the problems, uh, resolve, no pun intended, some of the issues I had with the earlier video on audio noise reduction. This is the right way to do it. I hope your results are absolutely fantastic. Let me know in the comments below. This has been Kerry with Learn DaVinci Resolve. Thanks for watching. Be sure and subscribe and click on that notification bell so that you get notified every time I put out a new video. Thanks for watching. I will catch you guys next time. Bye-bye.